The Portland Royal Casino continues to suffer massive financial losses thanks to the ongoing war between the NCR and Legion. With the casino right in the thick of the battle, patronage now numbers in the tens, with the casino's owner, Boss Carla, drowning in debt. In an attempt to boost revenue, the Royal held a special promotion, selling chips for half of their actual value. Only three people showed up. Don't change the channel. Casino. Casino. Hmm. I wonder if this is the casino. Casino! Is this the casino? Nobody at the front desk. I'm not an expert in casinos, but aren't there normally people? Yo. You gonna buy something or what? Oh. Is, is this a trading post? It seems bad now, I know. But this place used to be full of traders. What happened? The war. No one wants to carry goods when you could be ambushed by a legion or a corrupt NCR. I haven't had a caravan come by here in years. The only good thing to come out of the NCR was my boyfriend, Joseph. Oh. At least until he disappeared without a trace. Probably found somebody hotter. He's probably dead by now. Or, or that, yeah. Uh, okay, good luck selling your wares to nobody. See ya. <laughs> it's, yeah, I, I heard an advertisement for this place on the radio. Got got a question why they're advertising an empty casino. Hey, somebody's working here. Come on up, friend. My name is Ralph Meridew, floor manager of this fine establishment. May I interest you in a game of cards this evening? So, how's business? Business is wonderful. Business is beautiful. Yeah. Business is not great. Oh, really? It wasn't always this way. The Portland Royal used to be filled to capacity. Then the war started. The stadium became a Legion stronghold and people stopped coming. Oh no. I can't say I blame them. Hard to justify going through a war zone to lose some caps. <sighs> You're the first fresh face we've seen in the last year. Normally it's just me, Boss Carla, and Temperance. <laughs> the only face you've seen in a year? How are you still operating? Why are you still here? I'm loyal. Boss Carla helped me out of a jam a few years back. I owe her my life. Okay, why is Boss Carla still here? Well, first of all, she's invested too much time into this place to just walk away. Second of all, if she left, that debt collector over there would probably send bounty hunters after her. She's trapped in this place. We all are. You've had a year of nobody coming in here, and the debt collector hasn't broken all your legs yet, huh? So does the Legion give you any trouble? None. As long as we don't serve any NCR patrons. Not hard to do since they don't come here anymore. This seems like the kind of place the Legion wouldn't permit. Maybe they don't know about your existence yet. I may have to snitch. Be seeing you. Hello. I'm Boss Carla. If you're here to talk business, then we talk. Oh, a ghoul. Otherwise, get out. Why are you called Boss Carla? Isn't it obvious? I own the casino. That makes me the boss. It's not rocket science. I guess not. Pretty nice office for somebody not pulling in income. Believe it or not, the casino was actually pretty luxurious a few years back. It was only after that war with the Legion that everything went downhill. I find that difficult to believe. Why are you restoring this casino? Portland had a need. That need was gambling. Like any good businesswoman, I sought to fulfill that need. Do you often do business with the Legion? They don't like to gamble. Distracts from their training. Hmm. Besides which, I'm a woman and they take offense to that. For a moment, I thought Valerius might have been too permissive. You said you had some business for me? Goddamn debt collectors are breathing down my neck. I took out some money. 200000 not unreasonable. Had to spend most of it just getting the tables in working order. I've kept the collectors off my back this long, but eventually my luck's gonna run out. Uh, is there anything I can do to help? 
close the door. Make sure you're listening because I'm only going to say this once. I'm going to have to fake my death. And I'll need your help to do it. Sure, I can do that. Hello. The name's Sebastian. Gil Sebastian. And unless you've come on behalf of Boss Carla, we have nothing to discuss. Are you the debt collector that's been hounding her? I want you to know that Boss Carla asked me to kill you! Did she now? I suppose it was only a matter of time before she tried something like this. Thank you for telling me. We'll take care of this from here. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Put. Them. Down. Oh. And we're gonna gun down the car dealer. Alright. Nice. They have good stuff on them. <laughs> I'm sure. You forgot about Boss Carly. Hey. She's still alive. Oh. Let's see. Is Boss Carly gonna win? I don't... Ooh. Ooh. Whoa. <laughs> there goes the collector. <laughs> Come on, buddy. Don't be a coward. It's just one woman. Okay, fine. Let your help do it. Is she dead? Yeah, she did. She's super dead. So that's that. What happened? She's dead? What? Darn it! We'll never get our cabs back now! <laughs> this is all a waste of time! You did it! You, well, your subordinate did it. Hey, put in a good word for me with your boss. Let him know that the Legion is here and they get results. That did not go at all like I planned. Alright, well, they can't all be winners, I suppose. News reports indicate that the Frost Lion Resort, the infamous base of the Sundown Syndicate, has become infested with vicious mutants. Sundown is counted among the dead, and it's believed that this will serve as the final nail in the coffin for the long-suffering Syndicate. Seems pretty quiet for a resort. Maybe they haven't had business in a year either. Hmm. Dead slaver outside. That's a strange omen. Ooh. We seem to have Mr. Fracas. A lot of dead bodies. And dead slavers. Ooh. Locking on! Oh, oh got some bugs! It says beware on that wall. Ah! Yeah, you seriously gotta stop using a wrench. Getting rough out here. Yeah, use a firearm. Ooh. <laughs> That's, uh... Ugh. <laughs> it's a parasite using a uh, human head as its shell. <laughs> what the fuck? That is fucking cool. I love it. Also, I'm weirded out by it. Why is it the rest of the game like that? All right, what happened here? Who killed these slavers before I could? Here I thought I could take out the competition, but somebody beat me to it. Ah, uh, it's just a list of prices. Uh, female virgin, female, male, female, yeah, it's just, it's just prices. I feel like a, a pregnant female would be like one of the cheapest ones. Oh, thank you for your appraisal. Just saying, now you got two mouths to feed. But eventually, she won't be pregnant anymore, and then you'll have a woman! Yeah, but she also can't do anything, because she has to raise the child. Not if you turn the child over to the state! Let the state raise it! There is no state, it's a post-apocalypse. No, Kaiser's Legion is the state! Oh. That, that's how the Legion operates. Okay. You, Sorry, I'm with you again. I realize I, you've been out of the Legion for quite some time. It's been a bit. I've been dead for a while. Yeah. Randall, those fucking spider things from the basement came back. They're eating our merchandise, so I moved the premier stock to our upstairs pen. Ooh, okay. Joey set up some mines in the hall to blow the shit out of the fuckers if they try to come upstairs. Oh, watch out for booby traps. Wait, how would mines stop? Eh, whatever. Make sure you have extra muscle to watch the slaves and keep clients from asking questions. They're gonna want to know why there's bugs everywhere. I told Archie to lower the price of the bar as an incentive to keep clients in the auction hall. Do your best to convince clients to buy rather than stick around. Got it? Do what you can with bids. I'll see what I can do with the control. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Sundown. Ah, oh, the Sundown Crime Syndicate. Yes. That's not a member of the Slaver Syndicate. Warhead. Okay. Warheads. We have some intel on Violet Osborne's whereabouts. According to our sources, she has been seen here. 
This place is known as a den for human trafficking. The slavers rent slaves for any purpose desired. Ooh. As long as it happens inside the resort. Ow. Oh. Extra is charged if they die in the process. The better slaves are sold in an oct- Okay, that's just the business report. Your job is to extract Violet Osborne and bring her back to Shady Sands HQ. Eliminate the Sundown Association's human trafficking ring, which means killing Dr. Jeremiah Sundown Rivera. NCR will be of no help as Rivera has bribed a few higher-ups to look the other way. It's up to you, Warheads. Uh -huh. So the Warheads were the anti-slaver faction. And they came here to rescue a slave from the slavers. And at the same time, a parasitic infestation broke out. Dead slave. Yeah, not a lot of survivors. Just to, I guess the parasites won the, the three-way battle. It's alright, I'm not jumpy. I see you there. Any more of you? Yeah, there is more of you. Ugh. All right, let's check the basement out. Eliminate any blood bugs you see, and any anti-slavers, and any rival slavers. And basically anybody that's not a slave, kill them. <laughs> Especially kill these bugs. You know, bugs are a dog's delicacy. Well, then maybe we should have brought yours. Okay, there's nothing down here. We'll, we'll start making our way to the top floors. Nope. Hey, we uh, ooh. We're just killing all bugs. All right, yeah. Uh, temporary truce with the anti-slaver guy here. Ooh. What'd you just kill? Oh, it's slaver. Uh, we'll help you, anti-slaver. Kill some slavers. Yep, yep. Oh, no. The anti-slaver died. And he got caught in the crossfire. So sad. There's a lot more combat going on on the upper floors. You guys cleared this room? Well done. <laughs> Blood everywhere. <laughs> oh, we got some slaves here. Hey, don't worry. We're going to clear this place out for you. And we'll take you back with us. Just going to lock you in here. All right, you stay there. We'll be back for you. Hello. Hey! No, that was... Kind of you, thank you. I don't want to rescue you. Ugh. Wouldn't mind some stim packs right about now. Yeah? I think she'd appreciate them too. Yeah, if, if you. Uh, uh, yo, uh, Reg, you need a heart? A second heart? Because the doctor was taking organs out of slaves. Because he doesn't know. Some people just don't know how to treat slaves, you know? Hey. These things are some ugly motherfuckers. Yep, they are definitely gross bugs. Go, get to the vertebrate. I can handle this. I'm sorry, the fact that his name was Dutch and he was on an Arnold Schwarzenegger reference, yeah. that's awesome. <laughs> that's freaking awesome. I'm glad you enjoyed that. That is, uh, that's fun. <laughs> sorry, sorry, we, we can't... We can't risk you stopping us leaving with the slaves, if there are any more left to rescue. Oh, you seem badly wounded. Oh, you're part of the anti-slaver faction. Came here to rescue some slaves. Ah, oh, but you died here on the floor. I, I didn't even do that one. She gave me a gun, though. It's a pretty nice gun. <laughs> Maybe not great for clearing out a building. Still, thank you. Is that an H and K four sixteen? You know what's more impressive? The fact that you could identify this gun, even though I didn't describe it to you in the slightest. Hello. Hey, is that the head slaver? Don't hit the merchandise. Fuck. Nice try, scumbag. Sundown Association Legion Agreement. Wait, what? This is an agreement between the Sundown Association and the Legion to undercut or eliminate all other rival slaver companies in the region and in turn receive immunity from the Legion's wrath. Why did nobody brief me on this? I spent this entire... No. Oh, I, I just went through the entire tower and killed all the Sundown guys. Legion has agreed to split ownership 75-25 to drive down NCR troops. Y you know what? Well, now we have full ownership of all slaves in the area. Uh... 
That's right, we were just using you, Sundown Association. We used you to kill all other slavers in the area, and then we killed you. Now we are the only slavers in the area. We're, sl we're not slavers, French. I'm not, I don't know. What, we're definitely slavers. We're definitely slavers. <clears throat> Congratulations, you are being rescued. Please do not resist. I'll just remove that slave collar. I... I I'm free? Uh, well, thank you. I, I don't know what to even say. Excuse me, I, I... I need some time to clear my head. We don't have time for that. Get back down to the ground. Good. Bind your own hands. Also good. Thank you. Wow, you're really good at this. A professional slave, I, I guess. I was just removing that disgusting sundown slave collar to make way for a new, better legion slave collar. You'll like these. They're tight. <laughs> these things are still so damn cross. <sighs> it's good to be back in Ostia. Pardon me, I have a delivery to make. I guess I am a courier after all, huh? Boop. Boop, boop, ba -doop, boop, 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 boop. Hey, how's it going, Edmund? Yeah, keep on being cool. All right, down here in the sex chambers. All right, drop you off. Uh, no, where you think you're going, Violet? No, 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 no. There you go, and we'll just lock this. All right, so you are now a slave in the Legion. Please. I just need time alone. You've got plenty of time, Violet. Hope you enjoy your stay down here. Depending on your actions, it could last a while. Or you could be executed. It all depends on you. How you doing? Yeah. Man, how many sex slaves does one legget need? And now, the news. As of this report, the dreaded market sniper remains at large. Numerous caravans carrying life-saving supplies have been lost thanks to this individual, and worst yet, most do not even know he exists. Until the market sniper is brought to justice, we implore our listeners to stay away from the area and warn caravans away from the path. Stay safe and watch each other's backs, because no one else will. In a war fought with lies, truth. Hello. Damn it. What's up? A man just died. Oh, I didn't see that. Was he killed by a sniper? I heard this place had a sniper problem. Yes, it was a sniper. Most likely Legion. We were traveling to Junkfleet to trade and camp out here for the night. When we woke up, that sniper started picking off anyone who tried to leave. We ran out of food days ago. He got desperate and decided to run. I don't know who you are, but you look like you can handle yourself. I'll give you what we have left if you can kill that sniper. Ooh, I don't know. I kind of like my head where it is. Fuck you! I'm not convinced this guy is with the Legion. Why would he be assassinating random people, hmm? What's his end goal here? To make people hate the Legion? That's not what we want. Let me go investigate, figure out who's really behind this. That's the bank tower right there. Oh, can I see him? There they are! What? Oh, that thing. That's not a sniper, but that's a problem for us. That'll do. Okay. Now the actual threat, I don't see. Oh shit! Taking cover! Why would the scavs be protecting a Legion sniper? It doesn't make any sense, right? Danger! Close! Now that we've killed his defenders, let's get in the bank. Knock, knock! Hey! I see you, Scav! You're not getting away! Nice little operation you got here! <clears throat> Convince everyone there was a Legion sniper? Yeah, we definitely believe that! <sighs> Elevator out of order. Guess we're taking the stairs! Floor 2. Uh-huh. Mm-hmm. 
Fourth floor, dingleberries and ashtrays. Sixth floor, butts, butts, and more butts. Got a dead protectron with the hatchet in it. <laughs> Seventh floor, makeup and more. Oh my god, that's turret. Eighth floor, spare turret parts. Nope, okay, cutting to the eighth floor. Lab number one, hello. Time to die, robot. And a few more. A lot of you aren't there. Nice going, boss. Thank you. I'm quite proficient at killing robots. Which is good because there's a lot of them. Get back, folks. I have run out of ammo for that gun and I'm now using my spear. <laughs> Alright. Landmines. Should have been paying attention. This tower's seen better days. Yup. Out of my way. And you. Hey, are we on the roof? Oh, we're getting there. Ooh, dead body. Last words. Crap, I fell. Broke my leg. I'm not gonna make it. I was trying to get through that broken window up top. Maybe figure out how to stop that sniper. I got careless, slipped in. Uh, I can hear one of them protectrons closing in. I won't be around much longer. Mark, I love you. Blech. Where you failed, I will succeed. Or at least not suck nearly as much. Ooh, careful. Top floor. Oh, boy. I say careful, and then they... Whew. All right. The heck? Oh. Uh, whew. All right. Soft jump. Safe jump. Okay, that, that's bullshit. I fell through. Yep. All right. 33rd floor. The higher we go, the worse off everything looks. I'll take care of them. Yep. Nice going, boss. Follow me. Yep. Oh. You're a tough one. Your brethren ran down in one hit. Ugh. Top floor yet? I think we're at top floor. Yeah. Top secret material. The bet. Lieutenant Dole and I have made a bit of a wager. A bet. Those fools in the AI program have no clue what they're doing. Obviously, they should have kept me on board. But whatever. I'm on to bigger and better things. Like making a hundred bucks from Dole, for example. This is pre-war garbage, isn't it? He doesn't think the sniper system can protect the city, and since the army is shutting the project down, I won't get to prove him wrong, or will I? I said I can activate the system, put it on the roof of the building under the guises of standard testing, and hide it in the shed, and that whenever the Chinese invade, this building will be the only uninvaded one in the city. There's a reason why it won't quit shooting anyone on sight. It's because I went in behind everyone and fucking fixed it. <laughs> But will they listen to me? Of course they won't. And now I've got to turn into the, the mad scientist seeking approval. So they made an auto turret. And it's been shooting people around the tower for 200 years. Marvelous. Well done. Well done. Sincerely, Dr. Jim Peterson. Yeah, you won the bet. Good job, moron. Set the Legion as targets. Set the NCR as targets. Kill the scavs. Set the NCR as targets, obviously. That's right, NCR! Get torn apart! I don't know if this thing can reach all the way to the NCR base, but I'm assuming it just killed some NCR soldiers. Alright! Hopefully that won't backfire on us! Woohoo! Hey, I'm back! Well? I've taken care of the sniper for you! When we get back to Junkfleet, we'll tell the people to avoid that tower. But before I go, I have a question. What's that? Who is the sniper working for? Legion, right? No, of course it wasn't Legion. No, it was the NCR, of course. The NCR hates the locals. NCR? Those bastards. Bright Town was bad enough and now this? Junkly's not going to forget this. Be sure to tell all your friends that some Legionaries came by and helped you out. Because Legionaries are cool, right? Legionaries are cool. It's now been close to three months since we lost all contact with Snowblind Point. Our listeners will likely remember that the town is the site of the Snowblind Massacre committed by the NCR. 
They will likely also remember that this area was recently turned into a tourist trap, of all things, by a shady businessman named Joe Goddard. And now, we are unable to contact Goddard. We initially assumed that he took the caps and ran, but none of the reporters sent after him have come back. We pray for the safe return of our people and hope the situation at Snowblind Point is resolved soon. There's more. Ooh. Somebody turned somebody to ash here. Not entirely sure who or why. Oh, hello. Hello, anybody home? Hey! You want small talk? Go to Goddard. Who are you? Just a merc. Working for Goddard? Okay. Are you Goddard? Well, aren't you a hell of a sight. I thought I was finally going cuckoo when you came up over that hill. The whole town is trapped from hell to back. If you got through all that, you must be the luckiest guy in the wasteland. I don't believe we've met. Dang. Look at me droning on like we're old friends. You're speaking to Jameson Francis Goddard, but you can call me Jay. I'm the fastest talker in the West, and Golden Globe's top male actor, four years running. Oh. Isn't Golden Globe's a porn studio? I knew that off the top of my head for no reason. You gotta make a living somehow. So you're not from around here? What gave it away? My clothes or the fact that I can string together a coherent sentence? I'm from Nevada, New Reno to be exact. Best place around. The ladies down there know how to use their hands, if you catch my drift. Ah, NCR scum. So what happened here? This place used to be some kind of bungalow for tribals. Got along well enough until the NCR decided to bury them under the snow. Should have been the end of them. Mm -hmm. But tribals are stubborn. <laughs> yeah. Legend has it that they hid their greatest treasure somewhere around here. One final middle finger to the bear. A oh, treasure hunt, huh? Is that why you're here? I was trying to find that treasure, just like all the other goo piles outside. Something the legend didn't tell you is that there's a psychotic son of a bitch with a laser rifle waiting up by the ridge. If it wasn't for Ronald here, I'd be stuck to the bottom of your shoe. Another sniper, huh? Listen. I know we just met, and there's nothing really stopping you from just shooting me, but maybe we can work something out. Mm. You take care of that eagle-eyed psycho, and I'll make it worth your while. What do you know about this shooter? Are they also a 200-year-old automated turret? Didn't even know he was there until he started shooting at me. Most would say that it's just some chemmed up crazy. You ask me, though, he's NCR, or on their payroll. Why would NCR hire a sniper? Did you hear about the last NCR sniper? The locals and Blackthorn's boys get along about as well as a Deathclaw and a Cazador. Whenever NCR fucks up, they like to pretend, eh, it didn't happen. They did it with Brighttown, why wouldn't they try to do it with this place? My guess is that they hired the guy to keep people away from the town. Probably. Why do you need me to take care of him? You got this far. There are way worse bets than you. What about the treasure? You can have it. It ain't worth dying over. Okay, I'll take care of him. Luck's finally back on my side. Just let me know when the bastard's dead. I won't be going anywhere in the meantime. Yeah, yeah, I can handle him with my brand new sniper rifle. So, you want a sniper battle, do ya? Ooh. Lots of ash pot. Oh, hello. Ow! Bastard booby trapped the bridge. Now, I don't see any of these landmines. You see? Are they. Nope. Oh. Nice. <laughs> oh, oh, they spotted us. Two can play this game. He's no longer shooting at us. I either killed him or he's badly wounded. The heck? Oh. He scurried down this hole, huh? Oh, Enclave. Alright. We got a bunker here. Uh, hello. Hey! Ooh, bear traps. Hey! The Codex protects, 
Protect the Codex. Always check sightliness. Prepare the traps. Huh? C commander Reynolds? Is that you? This guy seems a few bolts short of a bucket. Uh, yes, it's me, Commander Reynolds! Commander, it's good to see you after so long. I did what you asked. I defended the bunker. Rain, shine, snow, heat, night, day. It didn't matter. I did my duty. The Codex protects! Refresh my memory. What were our orders? Thirty years, five days, twenty-four hours. The Enclave was coming. Destroying our posts. You ordered me to stay here. To protect this bunker. <laughs> to keep it out of the hands of the Enclave and the savages. Mm -hmm. I've done that. I never stopped. Never slept until the job was done. And you realize you're killing civilians, right? Savages, you mean. Scavs, they call themselves. But mm -hmm. they're all savages. They don't know what's in here. They don't know how to use it. They're like... Like children. Stupid, stupid children. And I have to protect them. Protect them from themselves. Not, you're not entirely wrong. So what exactly is in this bunker? Advanced pre-war tech. Enclave. Unknown Ooh. purpose. We were gonna take it back to California. To Elijah. But, but then they came from the sky. Who? Enclave? They came out of nowhere. No mercy. They destroyed everything. Didn't leave a trace. I thought you were dead. I thought they killed you. I, I thought I saw them kill you. I thought I was the only one they missed. I thought a lot of things. Uh, well, I will leave you to it then, soldier. Sir, yes sir. Gotta fix the traps. Do another patrol. Gotta... Okay. I gotta get some rest. That's right. That's right. Power armor? Ah, oh, gross. Fuck Ted. Fuck you, Ted. Fuck you, planning. Fuck you, family. Fuck you, cat food. Fuck your cat. Okay, okay. Fuck the fact that you literally stocked this bunker with just cat food. Fuck me. I hope you choke on cat food, Ted. <laughs> Alright. Uh-huh. The big stick. It's a sword. Like a spear, but worse. Mm -hmm. uh, winterized NCR gear. Not terrible. Uh, it just turned out to be a bunch of cat food and NCR armor. Lame. Hey, look at me! I'm an NCR dork who's wearing dorky NCR armor. Actually, I think Woolpiss might like this back home. It's got dead fox on it and everything. Keeps your shoulders warm. I thought that armor was pretty cool. Yeah, but it was NCR armor, so I couldn't wear it. You could've just scratched all the NCR stuff off. Still, a desert duster. People are gonna make assumptions. Yeah, but then that means that you can go places unimpeded. Or you're saying I could use it as a disguise. Yeah. I just don't think it looks good on me. If, you know, I think it might look good on you. Hmm, maybe. If only I could bring you back to life so you could wear it. Yeah gonna have to keep on wearing the clothes you're wearing now, which probably smell bad because you can't wash them. Well, I'm I'm a ghost, so they don't smell like anything. Ghosts don't have a scent. Really? Yeah. So you say you can't smell anything. Uh, no, I can still smell stuff. I don't know what you're talking- Oh, oh, god! Oh, good god, man! Aha! Caught it alive! Oh, what did you- Oh, uh, uh. I had NCR food, military rations, oh, four oh, fingers man. of death. Oh, it smells so bad. So apologize for lying. I did. I wasn't lying. I said we don't have a scent. Not that we don't have a sense of smell. Oh. So oh God. So, okay. Oh, why aren't I moving upwind? <laughs> okay, we'll just put one of these here, and then we'll do one of these. I think it's unfazed, actually. Wow. Okay. Plan B. The big stick. Aha! Yes. Hey, I'm back. Yo. Don't worry. I killed the shooter. Hell of a thing you did. Most people I know would have folded. Not you. I owe you a serious debt. And I pay my debts. 
Mm -hmm. Here's the dough. Clean as an angel. Come back around sometime, and I might have more for you. I didn't do it for the bottle caps. I did it to protect the frontier from the NCR. Spread the word. NCR loves shooting people. Boy, oh boy, they can't get enough of that. Oh, jeez. Hello. Oh, jeez. It's not as comical anymore. Oh, jeez. This thing is vicious. Holy hell. Okay. Uh, you know what? I think I'm over in over my head here. I should leave. I'm getting out of here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This is not for me. 